Hello, welcome to my channel. This week we're going to make a stunt hammer out of this foam. Basically a stunt prop is very safe to use. So I can hit people all day and do not hurt them. These are more commonly used in film, TV and theatre. And the first thing I do is draw out a rough shape of a hammer. And then cut it out with an extremely sharp blade. You may have to make a few passes with this. You will have to sharpen the blade quite a lot as using foam dual blades. And eventually you'll have a basic shape of a hammer cut out. Right, it's a bit untidy around the edges so I've trimmed off some of the excess. So Dremel does most of the work from here on in. This is where I smooth everything out and add shape. You may notice that it's starting to look a little bit shiny. That's because I've given it a blast with a heat gun. And this hardens the outer foam a little bit, therefore making it easier to cut away. I use a sanding sponge to help smooth out the rough areas. actual sandpaper and now it's time to mark out and then cut out the claw and I use a blade to go on some line for the handle this will help sell the wood effect and a quick blast of the heat gun will help open them up and now it's time to add some plastic coat primer this stuff is flexible so it won't break when you bend it for the wood I brush on some brown shoe polish this will create a nice wood effect Plus it's flexible. Using a tatty old brush I drive us on some cream colour just to help create the wood grain effect. hammer I rub on some rub and buff. This is a wax based polish and also flexible. And once that's all done I seal everything in with a matte sealer. that one completed hammer. And nope, I can't feel a thing. And the pen doesn't crack when you bend it. If you get a little too close you can tell it's not real. But from a distance you can get away with it.
Thank you for watching. Don't forget, if I can do it, so can you.